What's up, mga tulidots? Welcome back again to my channel. If you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, just click the subscribe button and hit that bell notification so you get updated for the future videos as well. So, for today's video, I'm gonna show you how I make fresh water using the seawater. Yes, you heard it right. We make our own fresh water here. Well, normally we purchase tons of fresh water in the port we paint before going to the next port. But sometimes during the voyage, we were lacking of fresh water because people here consuming a lot of it. So, let's go. Now I will walk you through the system. First thing to do is open that bulb. That bulb is connected to the seawater line that will be converted to a fresh water. Next is going to the filters. First filter is that oil and water separator. To remove the property of natural oil in seawater before going to the next filter, which is the commercial filter that separates foreign bodies before entering the next filter which is the membrane now here is the major filtration takes place because membrane has several filter elements that filters the molecules of salt microorganisms viruses etc etc now the permeate water will go to the charcoal filter and after that the fresh water will go to the uv sterilizer and the produced fresh water will go to the fresh water tank or the reservoir. Now the concentrated water or the excess seawater used in the process is thrown in this valve, the overbolt of the fresh water generator. Now I will show you how I operate reverse osmosis. First of all, open all the external valves including the inlet seacock valve and any valves installed on the brine line or on the product line of the system and as you can see I'm bleeding the filters to remove air before starting pump now let's go to the panel of the reverse osmosis next step is to open the back pressure regulator valve fully by turning it counterclockwise there since the electrical power source is on Start the booster pump immediately and check if the pressure is in normal state. After that, start the high pressure pump a few seconds later. Adjust the back pressure regulator to the recommended pressure to achieve the proper product flow. Now this light indicates the state of the water produced. It is safe when one to three green lights are present. Now as you can see, with a pressure of 50 kg per centimeter squared, we produce 200 liters of water per hour. Thank you guys for watching. If you like the video, just leave a thumbs up there or comment your reactions about this. If you want to see more of my videos, just only click the thumbnail below.